Hi there, I'm just uh, doing a video, quick video on something new that we've been working on. Um, it's a dual threaded adapter for your Megalodon Maco. Um, and basically, we've already been uh, sort of rolling them out, um, but we haven't sort of included the part which you need for the ATO one. So, as you can see with this new adapter, you have an external thread there. Um, which would be for the 801 atomizer and then you've still got the internal thread which is for the 510 atomizer so we've just added a, an external thread there now you'll see that the um, connect pin there is set quite low which means that it's impossible to use the 801 currently um, but obviously that works fine with the 510 because you've still got the internal thread there so what I'll do is I'll show you a new piece that um, we're going to be introducing which will allow you to use this 510 adapter which which you will have got in the last few months um, to, to be able to use it with an 801 atomizer so um, anyway first of all take take the Don screw it on there all the ad uh, adapters now so that's the 510 slash 801 and the 901 will uh, have a new system where they're screwed in from the outside so that we've brought the 901 up to date now and then just tighten that there we go that will kind of seal off I um, don't know if you noticed there was an o-ring on the underside that also helps seal um, the uh, Don so the liquid that kind of gathers in the um, uh, sort of cup there won't, won't go through um, so anyway there we have it, that's currently in 510 mode now with the Don and the Maco V3 it takes sort of a number of different atomizers, this is actually an Ego sort of XL um, atomizer which is sort of one of the really wide varieties but it's got a sort of skirt there which um, on normal mods or um, anything that isn't an Ego you wouldn't be able to use this but obviously the Don and the Maco have all been designed so that you can use this um, so I'll just screw that on there and you'll hear it I'll just there we go that's um that's working fine so that's the um don with the XL style atomizer um, so on to the new bit which is making it compatible with the 801 we're introducing this small machined part um, here it's a small brass part which um, basically all you do is you it's going to be a bit hard behind the camera you just screw it into the, the pin that's already there um, so that should screw on fairly straight fairly easily until pretty much it won't go anymore might be worth taking some pliers on that I'll just do, do it behind here so I can see what I'm doing and it ends up being fairly well flush by the time you screwed it down and will look like so it's just a little little piece that sits in the top there and then we take our 801 connector which is obviously using the threads on the outside and screw that on there there we go and I'll just give it a test go It's actually an old, a really old uh, 801 atomizer had lying around, so it's pretty much uh, hasn't been used for uh, probably about a year, but it's still just about working. Um, so anyway, that's that's the Don with the 801 um, atomizer there. So so basically, this part will be available very soon on our website, and it will be a lot cheaper 
to buy this than buy you know an entirely new uh, adapter so you know it, it sort of um, probably be well, it's definitely going to be under the five pound mark um, probably closer to two pounds fifty or somewhere around there and obviously it will give you that dual compatibility which um, which sort of uh, obviously gives you more options um, so anyway thanks for watching as ever and um, over and out